Gossips, trending, viral content, celebrity lifestyle. Welcome to Miracle Jameson. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If this is the first time here, kindly go to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you get notified whenever I drop a new video like this. So without so much of your time, let's get right into the gist of today. So guys, there's an update trending on social media right now and it's about Nera Mali's arrest. If you are a subscriber on my channel, you will know that this information is really not new to me because I already told you guys in my previous video which I uploaded about an insider who gave me a lot of information on this um, Mubarak's case and he revealed that Naramali was going to be arrested on the 3rd of October 2023 and truly Naramali was arrested yesterday October 3rd 2023 and this was confirmed by the police spokesman Benjamin Hondain on his Twitter account and it reads Aziz Fashola aka Naramali has been taken into custody for interrogation and other investigation activities. Then Neramali took to his Twitter account as well to confirm this. He said, I would like to share that I've just arrived back in Lagos, Nigeria to assist the authorities with the ongoing investigation. It's important I do my part for Imole. I'll be meeting with the police with hopes for the truth to be uncovered and for justice to prevail. So this was how Naramali actually reacted to his arrest which is currently trending on social media and now he's in police custody. I'm going to be playing the moment Naramali was actually picked up by the Nigerian police um, from the airport to where he was going to be interrogated concerning this Mobaz case. So without further ado, let's watch this video together. <laughs> So as you can see, Naramali was wearing a mask so that Nigerians would be able to identify him. Because right now he's like number one public enemy and considering the fact that he has lost quite a number of followers on his social media platform, for example, Instagram. So Nera is really scared and he made this known in the interview he did with Reno on Mockery where he said that he wanted full protection for the, from the police if he was to like arrive in Nigeria again. And Naramali actually took the bold step and came back to Nigeria and the police have done their part. We really look forward to seeing how this is going to turn out now that Naramali is now in police custody. I believe Naramali has a lot to say concerning the Mobad case because you know when Mobad was alive he said if anything happened to Rambi they hold Naramali Malia's music responsible and now Naramali is finally in the police custody and I trust the Nigerian police to do the right thing because right now a lot of Nigerians are really having double mind on this case so many people are even losing hope on the case already some people are saying oh the Nigerian police might not really do the right thing they are trying to kill the case and all of that but no I believe the Nigerian police are really working um, fast and they are really handling these things behind the scenes very well it's just that they are not keeping the public updated on some things like some of the persons interrogated so far they've not been um, revealed to the general public like the nurse have been interrogated the boys that were in the car have actually um, dropped their statement in the police station even Mobad's wife have written her own statement the mother the father so guys this is what's actually happening so far and I also saw a video of Mobad's father actually giving the go ahead for the wife mobad wife to do the dna test because a lot of nigerians are saying oh mobad wife to do the dna test if her hands are clean and all of that and up to this point the general public have not been updated on the dna test this thing have come to majority now not only nigeria so they should do the proper at the proper time. A lot of persons are saying many many things on this case and Mobad's wife have actually come out and said that she will do this DNA test while hoping for justice to prevail on this Mobad case and that is all the latest information and I think until um, 2 decades already 
making the second bearer plan for Mubad uh, alongside the Yabo. Are you checking this one? This is not Mubad. Not like the first one they did for him at Ikorudu. This time around, it's going to be much, much better than the first one so guys these are all the updates in this case the reason why this case is really dragging right now is because of the whole fast barrier that took place and the fact that they had to like wait for some days to get the approval of the father and some people in the community before they could like exhume his body and all of that for the autopsy so all those process really took a lot of time and that is why um the police are really bringing out this information slowly and it's making a lot of people flare up and all of that but i believe with time we'll surely get the truth on what really happened now that samilari and neramali are officially in the police custody <laughs> So guys, this is how I'll end the video. If there's any other thing you guys want me um, to check out, kindly let me know via my social media handles. I'll do all to check it out. So make sure you stay tuned to my channel. I have more updates coming for you guys. It's been your boy, American Jameson. I'll see you guys some other time. Peace out.